anything like America. The UK does not have freedom of speech. We haven't got freedom of speech in the UK. It's dead. The one citadel of freedom of speech in the UK is this corner. That's it. This is the only place. The, 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 uh, this, brother, don't. If you want to debate him, go somewhere else. Ladies and gentlemen, we don't have freedom of speech in this country. What we must do, ladies and gentlemen, would you like to debate? Would you like to debate? Right, come here then. Come here then. Come here. Come here then. Come here. No, we're not debating you. Lammy, we're not debating you. I offered him a debate. Lammy, since you're interrupting you're, you're me, you're you're going to interrupt me. Scared, I'm going to interrupt the Dawa. He's panicking. Lammy, 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 do you want me to interrupt the Dawa? He's going once. Lammy, do you want me to interrupt the Dawa? Going twice. Scared. Do you want me to interrupt the Dawa? Yeah, make your choice. Do you want me to go and interrupt the Dawa? Right, ladies and gentlemen. He's interrupted me, so now I'm going to interrupt the Dawa. Let's go and interrupt the Dawa. Then I need to approach this question with a sincerity. Yeah. Love for the truth? Yeah. And wherever the truth leads me to, I should be ready to accept that truth. Agreed. So this is the readiness of an individual to know where the truth is. That are the basics of where I think people are trying to interrupt our discussion. Yeah. If you feel that this is being interrupted, So we, we are you a Christian, bro? Huh? You're a Christian. No, sorry, I'm trying to. Sorry, go ahead, repeat again. Sorry, I couldn't hear. It's been a lot of my. Ears. So should we go to one side and talk? Discussion. Okay, we'll go to one side. Yeah. We'll follow you. We'll follow you. Well, then you're a stalker. Who's <laughs> <laughs> How are we doing, bro? Good to see you. Thank you. Manso, I'd like to challenge you to a debate. Why have you been lying about the Christian faith, Manso? Manso, why have you been lying about the Christian faith, bro? <laughs> Mansour, why does Allah say that? Why does Allah say that he can adopt one of creation to be a son, Mansour? Yeah. <laughs> Mansour, why? Mansour, why are you running? Why are you running, Mansour, from a debate? Hey, don't talk to the coward. Why am I a coward? I'm right here. You are a coward. Right here. Mansour! Mansour! Why does Allah say... Why does Allah say that he can adopt something in creation as a son? Why does he command Muhammad to say that if he had, a, had a son, that that son would be worthy of worship? Thank you. Don't push. Don't push. Don't push. Had Lemon not behaved in the way that he had, I wouldn't be like that. Great. I'm not interested in you. Great, but I'm interested in you. Because you go around and you lie about the Christian faith. You lie about the Christian faith. Go and speak over there. No, no, I'm good here. I'm good here. Thank you. 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 Let's go. 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 Let's go.
This interruption was brought to you by Lamin. If I Lamin not interrupted me, I would not be here now. And had Sam not pushed me, then I have been no pushing, ladies and gentlemen. However, since we're here, Mansour, I've got a question for you. Well, I want to ask you a question. So, why Muslims? Oh, he's running. He's running. Mansour, I'm challenging you to a debate right now, bro. Ah, so let me interrupt you. Yes, let me. Ah, okay, okay. No, he pushed. He pushed. You pushed. He pushed. Your mate pushes. Your mate pushes. You won't push me because you Sam, you, you pushed. Push That's stop what liar. started. Stop liar. Stop liar. You pushed. Sam, you mate. I was stood behind you. I was stood behind you, Sam. And then you pushed me. That's how it got started. Notice that Mansour is running away. Notice that Mansour is running away. Notice that Mansour is running away. Oh, why is he running away? The Dalek Gandhist always run away when they're challenged, ladies and gentlemen. They're always good to interrupt, but they don't like it if you do it to them. If they push, there's no arrest. We have two tier policing. Two tier policing. Just a bit of space for everyone. Just a little bit of small space. That's lovely. Right, ladies and gentlemen. Let's just talk about what happened. Why did I come and interrupt Mansour? I was over there doing my own thing, and then Lamin interrupted me. And I gave him three warnings that if he did not stop, I would go and interrupt the Dawah. Lamin, since you're interrupting me, going to interrupt me. I'm going to interrupt the Dawah. He's panicking, Lamin. Lamy, Lamy, do you want me to interrupt the Dawa? He's going once. Lamy, do you want me to interrupt the Dawa? Going twice. Do you want me to interrupt the Dawa? Yeah, make your choice. Do you want me to go and interrupt the Dawa? Right, ladies and gentlemen. He's interrupted me, so now I'm going to interrupt the Dawa. And Lamin did not stop. So all of you Muslims that are upset about what I did, go and speak to Lamin. And as for the pushing, if Sam Dawa had not pushed, there would have been no pushing because I was stood behind Sam Dawa, a gap emerged in the crowd, a, a gap emerged and I was walking through it and some tried to push me out of the way. Why does he command Mohammed to say that if he had a, had a son, that that son would be worthy of worship? Thank you. Don't push, don't push. Don't push. But let's talk about this coward Mansour okay, okay. and let's talk about all the cowards in the Dai. Okay. Because they're all afraid okay. to debate Christians. Ah, okay. They are only courageous to debate young, in, influential, uh, easily influenced young men. They don't challenge Christians that can debate them back. When I've finished. Now, ladies and gentlemen, yeah. I challenge any Muslim to answer this question What's for me. Question? It's a really simple question. Oh, well, yeah. Why does your God permit shirk in the Quran? Here's where he permits shirk. Your Quran says that if Allah had so wished to have a son, okay. he could adopt anything from his creation as a son. And your Quran says, say, O oh Muhammad, yes. if Allah had had a son, okay. I would have been the first to bow down in worship. Okay. Why is Allah saying that if Allah adopts a created thing, okay. that created thing could be worshipped as a god? Oh, that's shirk. That's shirk, yeah, brothers and yeah, sisters. Yeah, shirk in your Quran and shirk that Mansour is frightened to answer, frightened to debate, 
Because as you have just seen, yeah. when the Christians who know what they're talking yeah, about they challenge the Muslims, <laughs> they run. They run because they're afraid. It's really simple. If you don't interrupt me, I won't interrupt you. That's the deal, Dawagandis. And Lamin broke that deal. You don't really agree that Muslim exist eh? as per the Judaism and Christianity, but you don't really believe that Muslims is right. I don't believe that Islam is true. And the reason why, the reason why I don't believe, the reason why I don't believe that Islam is true. Wait, I'm the church is closed. The question is, oh, and we make it most. why the many, church many, is many. turning to the mosque? So, ladies and gentlemen, there is this taunt beloved by Muslims. Why are churches turning to mosques? Exactly. Ladies and gentlemen, there's no denying it. There are examples of churches turning to mosques. Lots of them. But if you look at what kind of churches are being turned into mosques, they're churches that are run by liberal progressives. In other words, they're churches that don't believe in the Christian faith and they don't practice the Christian faith. But, ladies and gentlemen, but, ladies and gentlemen, he needs to ask himself, why is Christianity growing in Saudi Arabia? Why is Christianity grow? Why was Christianity growing in North Sudan? Why was Christianity growing in Iran? Ladies and gentlemen, why is the fastest growing religion in Indonesia Christianity? You see, we can both play this taunting game, but that has nothing to do with what is true. It doesn't matter if every church turns into a mosque, it doesn't make Islam true. And I'll prove that to you. Because in an imaginary world, where every mosque turned into a church, would that be proof that Christianity is true? No. No. There you go. <laughs> and that's the point. Muslims make this taunt, not because it has any relevance to what is true, but because they're trying to dishearten you Christians. And, why is not and what you should do is allow to follow the example of Jesus Christ, who had zeal for the temple of God. And we must have zeal for the body of Christ. And when we have zeal for our faith, and when we unite and work together as Christians, then you will see success and advance. Since the Christians in this park started working together, more Muslims have become Christians from this park. The first person that I spoke to today in this park was a Muslim who had become a Christian. He's become a Christian from four months ago, ladies and gentlemen. He just got rid of his shahada and then got baptized. Yes. Yeah, to become a Christian. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. And that's happening, ladies and gentlemen, because of these videos and the work that we're doing in the park. But the work that we're doing in the park is successful because Protestants, Catholics and Orthodox are all working together for the kingdom of God, which proves that in unity there is strength. Next question. So he's gone from five prayers a day to how many prayers a day being a Christian? So I can't say... Do, do you see what I'm getting at? No, well, well, well let me address yeah, that point go on, go on, go on. So, ladies and gentlemen, Muslims like to boast about the fact that we have five prayers a day. I'm <laughs> saying what's holding you back because we Christians believe that we should be in a state of continuous prayer. What kind of God is it that turns around to you and says... But it's not and a says, though, that you can't pray to me at certain hours. Islam. Islam says that between the morning prayer and the afternoon, it's haram to pray. You can't do the salat. What a joke of a God Allah is. As Christians, we are to offer up our souls and bodies to be a living sacrifice to the Lord our God. Every act as the priests of God is an offering to God and we offer up all that we do to God as a living sacrifice 
to the Lord our God. Well, that is you? what worship is. Would you like to debate? No, 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 okay, we'll talk. We'll talk. No, 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 no. We'll talk. Question. I'm not going to debate you. Right, Just then let question. someone else ask the question.